to go with the wall of her. Let's stick in the shinty bowl to break the brack, the crack, and all. Let's call it an Irish pub. Okay, so, more wall frame. What else would it be, huh? Huh? So, anyway, following a few questions asked by you guys on my Push 4 to Win video about Mesa and what kind of peacemaker build I was using in the footage, and also how the hell was my Mesa firing her regulator pistols so damn fast? Because some of you had said that for you, your Mesa fires a lot slower or only fires in short bursts. At first I thought maybe I had missed some kind of a nerf to her peacemaker ability as my press 4 to win footage was over a week and a half old before I actually edited it and uploaded the video but I have tested it again and again since then to try and check it out and she still fires really really fast for me so fuck knows why it's not working for some of you guys it could be something as simple as computer specs a bit like how low frame rates can affect the speed of your melee swings with the dual icons or with the dual zorans basically if you're suffering from frame drops then you won't swing your weapons as fast so maybe mesa's peacemaker ability works in the same way I don't know. So I'll quickly show you my peacemaker builds that I use and hopefully it will be as effective for you as it is for me. Of course some of you will have different variations of this build so by all means let me know in the comment section what way you use run it and is it as effective for you as it is for me. So this build has one form and it is set up entirely with efficiency and power strength in mind as well as a small bit of duration for shooting gallery or shatter shield if I needed it depending on the mission. Now the former of course is for her aura. I changed it out for a dash for energy siphon or corrosive projection depending on my group or which mission I'm running and the build contains fleeting expertise and streamline for efficiency, transient fortitude and intensify for power strength. The prime continuity like I said is to give me that option to use shatter shield or shooting gallery if needed and then I have vitality for health and rage to give me some energy if needed. You could use quick thinking or a vigor if instead of rage if you wanted, especially against Grenier Corpus in the void, that's entirely up to you. Like I say in most videos, this might not be the perfect build for you, but it works absolutely brilliantly for me. And if you have a Mirage using Eclipse in your group or a Rhino using Roar, then expect much larger damage numbers. Also Nova, because Nova. And also following the fun that I had in the latest Escalation Tactical Alert, I've kind of had an urge to try this build on an infested defense mission solo and see how many waves I can actually manage with just Peacemaker spam and maybe a few try hard weapons to take down Eximuses and stuff like that in between the Peacemaker spam. Now the first 40 waves I imagine might be a little bit boring but I do think that after those waves shit might become really hectic and it should be a lot of fun so I'm going to do that and I'll eventually stick up the footage and see how far I actually get. Now Mesa isn't entirely tied down to just Peacemaker spam. There is another build out there at the minute that is absolutely incredible and I'm absolutely loving it on my Mesa. It is of course her Shatter Shield setup. Mesa becomes a very very tanky frame. Running her with Shatter Shield is probably now my favourite way to run solo missions. I've put down my Rhino and still only use my Valkyrie for when I'm running melee runs or leveling up melee weapons but Mesa having 95% damage reduction from incoming fire is amazing not to mention the percentage of incoming fire that is reflected back on the attacker not exactly massive numbers from the damage that's reflected back but it is extremely useful especially if you've got four crows of projections then that can alone take down enemies now the only downside to her shatter shield is it's no good against melee attackers or infested so grenier corpus or void is where you run with the shatter shield setup also eximus auras and more are gonna knock down still hit home but i think most players know when they see an eximus in a mission it becomes the main priority and ignore everything else until the Eximus is dead and the knockdowns from the Moas and the Gunners are easily avoided but I, I still get caught by them a lot because I'm an idiot. Now also the projectiles from the Bombards and the Napalms are reflected back to them as well provided that they don't splash off a surface beside you and they, they make direct contact with Mesa then they will of course be reflected back. You can basically just stand there and give the middle finger to the Bombards with a smile on your face. I honestly can't say it enough, this ability is amazing and some actually might say it's borderline overpowered compared to the likes of Zephyr's Turbulence or even Rhino with his Iron Skin. It is so much fun. So the Shatter Shield mod build that I've gone for is very similar to my Peacemaker build 
But I've dropped out the transient fortitude from the peacemaker build for a narrow minded and I've dropped rage for a four times leveled vigor. Now vigor of course is a personal preference as I prefer to have that little bit more health and shield as opposed to having the rage and the energy regen from it. So I have a streamline and fleeting expertise for efficiency intensify for the maxed damage reduction but I believe you can reach the max 95% reduction with an intensify that's only leveled one from the top. As I said I've got narrow minded and I've also got prime continuity for duration and vitality for health. Now the two builds of Peacemaker and Shatter Shield make Mesa an absolutely amazing frame. Definitely a frame worth having in your arsenal. Kind of sounded like I said arsehole there, but she can solo run missions with the best of them. And if you're wanting fast, easy grinding or leveling missions, then she can absolutely wreck large waves of enemies in the blink of an eye with Peacemaker. Now four players with corrosive projection and one Mesa in the group can just blitz missions really, really fast. But let me know what you guys think of Mesa and her abilities. Is Shatter Shield as good as I think it is? And how fast can your regulators fire? Hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and hit that subscribe button for more Warframe. And as always, thanks very much for watching. Rounding deep in my sea of loathing Broken to your serpent's eye We can give in to me It seems what's left of my human side Is slowly changing in me Oh, ah!